The deep sea, a world shrouded in darkness, cloaked in mystery. It is a place where light cannot penetrate, and the unknown reigns supreme. It is the largest habitat on our planet, yet remains largely unexplored. Despite its vastness, we have only just begun to scratch the surface of its secrets. It begins where sunlight fades about 200 meters below the surface where the ocean starts to turn pitch black and plunges down to depths of almost 11,000 meters to the very bottom of the Mariana Trench, the deepest part of the world's oceans. This alien realm, with its crushing pressures and frigid temperatures, is Earth's final frontier. It is a place where only the most resilient forms of life can survive. For centuries we imagined the deep sea as a barren wasteland, devoid of life and activity. We now know it teems with life. From the smallest microorganisms to the largest predators, the deep sea is a bustling ecosystem. Strange and wonderful creatures adapted to survive in this extreme environment call the deep their home. These creatures have evolved in ways that boggle the mind. Unseen by human eyes, they have evolved unique features and behaviors, such as bioluminescence and extreme pressure resistance, revealing the incredible power of life to persist even in the harshest conditions. Their existence challenges our understanding of biology and adaptation. The deep sea is not a separate world, it is a crucial part of our planet's ecosystem. It is intimately connected to our own. The deep sea plays a vital role in regulating our climate, cycling nutrients, and supporting a vast web of life, much of which remains unknown. The processes that occur in the deep sea have far-reaching impacts on the surface world. Exploring this hidden realm is not just about satisfying our curiosity, but about understanding our planet and our place within it. The more we learn, the more we realize how interconnected everything is. As we venture into the deep, we enter a world unlike anything we know. It is a realm of endless possibilities and discoveries. It is a journey into the unknown, a glimpse into the heart of our planet and the mysteries that lie within. Each expedition brings us closer to unraveling the secrets of the deep. It is a journey into the unknown, a glimpse into the heart of our planet and the mysteries that lie within. The deep sea holds the key to many of Earth's greatest mysteries waiting to be discovered. Imagine diving deeper and deeper into the ocean. Sunlight, our familiar guide, begins to fade. The warm, sunlit waters of the surface give way to a cool, twilight zone. Here, light dwindles with each passing meter, painting the water in shades of blue. This is the realm of the ocean's most efficient hunters, creatures equipped with large eyes and streamlined bodies perfectly adapted to life in the fading light. Deeper still, we descend into the midnight zone. Here, the last vestiges of sunlight disappear and perpetual darkness reigns. The pressure increases, a crushing weight bearing down from above. The temperature plummets, hovering just above freezing. Yet, even in this extreme environment, life finds a way. This is the deep sea, a world of extremes where survival depends on remarkable adaptations. The creatures that inhabit this realm are unlike anything found in the sunlit waters above. They are living testaments to the power of evolution, showcasing the incredible diversity of life on Earth. As we journey deeper into the abyss, we enter a world of wonder and surprise. Each layer reveals new secrets, new adaptations, and new forms of life waiting to be discovered. In the absence of sunlight, life in the deep sea has found its own way to illuminate the darkness, bioluminescence. This natural phenomenon is not just a spectacle but a crucial survival mechanism in the pitch-black depths of the ocean. This ethereal glow, produced by specialized organs known as photophores, paints the deep sea with flashes of light. These tiny, light-producing cells are scattered across the bodies of various deep-sea creatures, creating a mesmerizing underwater light show. It serves many purposes, attracting prey, confusing predators, and even communicating in the darkness. In a world where light is a rare commodity, these glowing signals become a language of their own, a means to navigate, hunt, and survive. The giant squid, a creature of myth and legend, is a denizen of these depths. 
Its elusive nature and rare sightings have fueled countless tales and speculations about the mysteries of the deep. This colossal invertebrate, reaching lengths of up to 13 meters, is a testament to the remarkable adaptations found in the deep. Its long tentacles and powerful beak are perfectly designed for capturing prey in the vast dark ocean. Its enormous eyes, the largest in the animal kingdom, are perfectly suited for detecting the faintest glimmers of light in the abyss. These eyes can spot the bioluminescent signals of other creatures, helping the squid navigate and hunt in the darkness. Other creatures, like the anglerfish, have evolved even more ingenious methods of utilizing bioluminescence. This small but fierce predator uses its glowing lure not just to attract prey, but also to communicate with potential mates. This cunning predator dangles a glowing lure in front of its mouth attracting unsuspecting prey to their doom. The light is irresistible in the darkness, drawing smaller fish close enough to be snapped up in an instant. The deep sea is a constant battle for survival, and bioluminescence is both a weapon and a shield in this silent war. Creatures use it to hide from predators, to startle attackers, and to find food in the inky blackness. The deep sea is a symphony of light and shadow, a world where life has adapted to the absence of sunlight in extraordinary ways. Each species has developed unique strategies to harness the power of bioluminescence, turning the darkness into a canvas of light. Every flash of bioluminescence tells a story, a glimpse into the complex interactions and survival strategies that define this unique ecosystem. These brief illuminations reveal the hidden lives of deep sea creatures their struggles and their triumphs in one of the most extreme environments on Earth. Section 4. Oases of the Deep Hydrothermal Vents Scattered across the ocean floor are hydrothermal vents, fissures in the Earth's crust where superheated water, rich in minerals, spews into the ocean depths. These vents, often found in volcanically active areas, create unique ecosystems completely independent of sunlight. Here in the darkness, thrives an unexpected abundance of life. Giant tube worms anchored to the seafloor dominate these oases. These bizarre creatures lacking mouths and digestive systems rely on symbiotic bacteria that live within their tissues. These bacteria convert the chemicals spewing from the vents into energy, supporting a thriving community of life. Mussels, crabs, and shrimp also congregate around these vents feasting on the abundant bacteria and the larger organisms that they support. Hydrothermal vents are a testament to the resilience of life, showcasing its ability to thrive in even the most extreme conditions. These oases of the deep offer a glimpse into the early evolution of life on Earth, a time when life may have first arisen in similar environments, fueled by chemosynthesis rather than sunlight. They are a reminder that life in its infinite forms can exist in places we never thought possible. Section 5. Feast or Famine – The Challenge of Finding Food In the vast expanse of the deep sea, food is incredibly scarce, making survival a daily challenge for its inhabitants. Sunlight, the engine of photosynthesis, does not penetrate these depths, leaving the deep sea in perpetual darkness. Instead, Life in the deep relies on a constant rain of organic matter, known as marine snow, drifting down from the surface. This marine snow is a crucial source of sustenance. This detritus, composed of dead plankton, fecal pellets, and other organic debris, provides a lifeline for deep-sea creatures, sustaining a delicate ecosystem. Scavengers like the deep-sea isopod roam the ocean floor, feasting on whatever scraps they can find. These creatures play a vital role in recycling nutrients. Others, like the vampire squid, have evolved elaborate webs of mucus to capture this falling bounty, showcasing the ingenuity of deep-sea adaptations. When a large carcass, such as a whale fall, sinks to the ocean floor, it becomes a feast for a variety of deep-sea creatures, providing a rare and bountiful meal. Hagfish, sharks, and amphipods converge, stripping the carcass clean in a matter of months, a macabre ballet of life and death playing out in the abyss. This event highlights the interconnectedness of deep-sea life. 
Life in the deep sea is a delicate balance, a constant struggle for survival in a world where food is scarce and opportunities are few and far between. Every meal is a hard-won victory. The adaptations exhibited by these creatures honed over millennia are a testament to their resilience and their ability to thrive in the face of adversity. Their survival strategies are as diverse as they are fascinating, reflecting the harsh realities of their environment.